guys, my name is Coach Shadow Dogs Bob Built for Theme Park News, and welcome to another Halloween update. Now, this is from Bush Gardens, Tampa, on their Sesame Street Kids Weekend. It's coming back for 2020. We have all the details surrounding that. Of course, things are subject to change between now and when the event starts, but we're going to share with you all the details revealed from the official park website. Like the Flamingo Land video we did earlier, we've got a link in the description down below where you can check out the website for yourself. Again, you can go and check out the Flamingo Land video we uploaded earlier. You can check out um, all the details surrounding their Halloween Hall Term event. And again, look in the description down below that video. You can check out the website. You can put your tickets for Flamingo Land. But you can check out the website link in the description below this video and check out Bush Gardens Temper and buy your tickets for yourself. But before you do, it's best to give you the details first. Now, before we get started, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, click notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. We're getting closer and closer to 1,900 subscribers, which means we're getting closer and closer to 2,000. So uh, let's hit 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year. We've only got a couple of months left to do it, but I think you guys can do it. I think, you know, we're, we're back. We're back, baby. We're back. But you can, uh, you can please help out the channel over the next couple of months as we get closer and closer to the 2K by the end of 2020. And for now guys, let's get into this video. Let's talk about Bush Gardens Tampa's brand new, or returning brand new, uh, Sesame Street Kids Weekends for Halloween 2020. So all the information is from the park's website and it says as follows, enjoy contact free trick or treating at a limited time Halloween show every Saturday and Sunday in October for Sesame Street Kids Weekends. Enjoys favorite furry friends getting into uh, the Halloween spirit every Saturday and Sunday in October as the Sesame Street's Kids Weekend. The park is, has implemented additional health and safety measures to offer contact-free trick-or-treating for kids and families throughout the spacious uh, Sesame Street Safari of Fun Play Area. Guests can also tune in to the Count's Not Too Spooky Halloween radio show starring Count Von Count and his Sesame Street friends available only during these special weekends. The outdoor Sunny Day Theatre offers physical distance seating for Sesame Street fans of all ages and uh, you can enjoy the show there. Families can also join the Cookie Monster for a special cookie decorating experience at the Guazi Pavilion, of course now known as Iron Guazi. Uh, included with park admission, reservations are required for park entry, events, dates and details subject to change and or cancellation without prior notice. You can check out all the details on the times and dates on the Bush Gardens, Sesame Street, Halloween Kids Weekend website which I've linked in the description just below the video. So not much in terms of times and dates there, but that is the details on what's coming up in this Sesame Street Kids Weekend. Again, massive props to Bush Gardens Williamsburg for trying to put this event on in the safest way possible with the COVID restrictions over in the States. And, um, you know, fair play to Bush Gardens Williamsburg for trying to stick to the rules as much as possible and trying to put this event on in the safest way they can. Um, some of the stuff there, like the cookie cut, uh, the cookie designing competition with the Cookie Monster at the Guazi Pavilion, of course, that's now going to be known as the Iron Guazi Pavilion. Uh, their brand new RMC, which has been rescheduled to 2021. Can't wait for that. And, um, you know, other things, the Count's brand new show, the, the not so... Not so spooky Halloween radio show thing. I think that's brilliant. The new live experience. So that's going to be a very good show as well. I'm sure there's going to be loads of Sesame Street characters out and about meeting the guests. And you can do photo points, I'm sure. Of course, it will be contact free. But, you know, I'm sure they can do like socially distanced photos, etc. If they can find a way to do it. But if not, then it'd be great to sort of you know, still see the characters roaming around the parks. Um, so very, very good stuff from there. Not the biggest video in the world for this one, just, just you know, first details. And like the, the article said on the website, on the official website of the theme park, you know, um, like it said, there's going to be changes, there may be a cancellation without prior notice, uh, which, you know, in my opinion, yes, it might be, you know, confusing with the guidelines and they might receive some stuff and they have to sort of cancel the event without letting people know. Um, but I think what they should do is, you know, give a, a notice. I think if they are going to possibly cancel it, I think give a notice. Um, and for those who have already booked tickets, they're on the list for refunds, etc. I think they'll probably do that, but I think there should be a notice if they are going to cancel the event. But as for now, still going ahead. And if you want to check out the times and dates uh, for all these activities and the dates of the event, then you can also check them out in that link in the description down below on the Bush Gardens Tampa website. 
Thank you very, very much for watching this Halloween update from Bush Gardens Tampa in Tampa Bay. You can check out the Flamingo Land Halloween half term details video that we uploaded this afternoon. And uh, for now, guys, my name is Coast Shell. Keep living the coast life. I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. We're back. Coast Shell is here. Thank you very much. Have a nice day.